Hey guys, it's Summer, and today's video is going to be all about these Milani Brilliant Shine Lip Glosses. I keep hearing a lot of people on YouTube talking about them. Um, some of them purchased them themselves, some of them got the whole line sent to them. So I was really curious to see what the truth was, if it was really worth the hype, you know. I just wanted to see what, what, what was really going on with these lip glosses. So my sister, who is kind of my partner in crime a lot of times when it comes to buying makeup, we kind of, um, what's the word when you have an addiction? Someone's helping you? Enable. We kind of enable each other. That's what I was trying to say. Okay, so she told me she got a couple and she really liked them and she said that they were on sale. So I went to CVS and they were on sale. They were buy one, get one half off, which is why I have six. But I'm narrowing it down and I'm probably only going to keep maybe, two. I'm definitely keeping two, maybe four, but not six. I have tested all of them out. They are definitely pretty amazing lip glosses for $5. I think they might actually be like $5.50. It really depends on where you're buying them. What I'm going to do is just kind of do swatches, tell you what I think about them, and I'm really excited because one of these is almost an exact dupe for a Chanel Glossomer lip gloss that I have and love and have been afraid to use too much because I don't want it to go away because they're pricey, those little things. I'm so excited to show you the dupe in here. Let's just go through the ones that I got and I'll do little swatches for you. The first one is in Sweet Grapefruit and it's just a peachy pink. This one does not have any shimmer in it whatsoever. So this one is, this one's really pretty. They definitely, um, this one in particular has more of a sheer, it doesn't have a whole lot of pigment, but um, it's still really, really pretty. So that is called the pink, no, sweet grapefruit. The next color is in Mauve Fetish. And it's a, well, this one does, does have a little bit of a shimmer to it. It's not a matte gloss. Although it looks like there's shimmer on in the tube, but then when you're swatching it, and I didn't even really see a lot of shimmer on my lips. So I'm gonna probably say this is more of a flat, like solid color. And so that's that one right there. Next up is the Rose Blush. Again, this one has, when you look in the, you know, the, what is this thing? Why can't I talk? When you look in the tube, it looks like it has some shimmer or a little bit of glitter, but actually you can see a little bit in the swatch. That's that bright pink one right here. I think I really like that one. I think Rose Blush might be a favorite. The next one is in Pink Lady. This is one I'm not sure about only because I already have a lot of pink lip glosses, but if you don't, this is a really, really pretty one. This is a flat pink. It does not have any shimmer or glitter or anything like that. That's this pink one here. Man, as I'm like swatching them all, I feel like I need them all. <laughs> Kind of, I kind of love them all. I don't know how to choose. Okay, the next one, this one is a definite. This is probably my most favorite one. And this is in Ravish Raspberry. And I like this one because it has the most pigment. It's a lip gloss, but like a lipstick gloss because it has so much color in it. And it is so pretty. Oh my gosh, this one is not going back. And that's that color. Okay, now I've saved the best for last, and this is the one that when I saw it at CVS, I thought, oh my gosh, that looks just like my Chanel Glossomer. This is in number 11. I don't know what, it, what the name of it is, but it's just this really pretty pinkish gold. Oh, it's so pretty. I mean, if you look at them side by side, 
Can you really see that? It looks like the same color. So I will swatch them next to each other so you can see. And the crazy thing is the consistency, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty amazing. Like how similar it is. I'm so excited. And, oh, this one is the Milani one. This is in Luminous, by the way. The only thing I would say it's a little bit different is I think the Luminous has a little bit more pink to it and the Glossomer has a little bit more peach to it. But they're so similar that I think if you're looking for a dupe or something to replace it, you can't go wrong with the Luminous. It's so pretty. So this one here is the Chanel and this one here is the Milani Luminous. So overall, I have to say I am definitely impressed. I do think that these are worth the hype and I do think they're worth $5, that's for sure. They stay on really well, like I said. They are a little bit sticky, so if you're not a fan of that, maybe these aren't the lip glosses for you, but I love them and I think the two that you have to own, have to, have to own, are the, oh, where did it go? Oh, here it is. The Raspberry, Ravish Raspberry, and definitely the Luminous. <sighs> I don't know how to narrow down these four. When I'm looking at them on my hand, I think that the one I like the most out of those four are the Rose Blush and... Huh. Oh gosh, I don't know. I don't know I like them all. I can't choose. I might just need to keep all of them and maybe just maybe gifts. I don't know. It's not hard when you know you don't need them but you love them. Does that happen to you? It's happening to me right now. Anyway, I hope that was helpful for you guys. I know that there are already a lot of reviews out there but if you just needed maybe that one more review to tell you that they are pretty amazing and I do think that you guys need to go check them out. They have a lot more colors than this. These were just the ones that I was drawn to and definitely wanted to try out and swatch for you guys. Yeah, that's all I have to say. <laughs> Hope you guys are having a great day. Thank you so much for watching, for subscribing, and I will see you guys soon. Bye.